There are three different types of arcs. There are serial arc, and it's caused by wiring discontinuity, such as loose connector or connector defects. We just mentioned it before. There is what it called parallel arc. It's because of insulation problem, problem between two adjacent cables. Remember, a cable exposed to the sun, as we mentioned before, the top part is exposed to the sun, the bottom part is not exposed to the sun. And if there are two adjacent connectors and have, that have cracks on the top part of the insulation, there can be an arcing between two adjacent connect, uh, ply, uh, cables. This arcing, basically, high temperature, high current, a pulse that immediately damage the cable, heat up the cable, creating a fire. Now, a parallel earth arc is usually caused by internal leakage inside the PV module. Remember, a PV module consists of, ce of cells, and there are a set of conductors that connecting the cells in series and in parallel. Now, all of it should be in dry, vacuumed area. If there is humidity that penetrates under the glass, the protective glass of the panel, then there might be a short between the conductors that, that take the current from cell to cell to cell in within a module. That can create an arc. And again, chain reaction. The picture on the left represents two different uh, situations in terms of arcing. The leftmost string affects its neighbor. It might not affect another string far away. So the two, two leftmost strings can have arcing, but the inverter will not feel it. If the inverter does not feel it, it sees, from his point of view, a well-performed system continue to convert DC energy into AC energy, while in the further away strings there are already fires. That means the response to the problem will be very late, too late. So this is why we need to identify arcing as it happens in order to avoid the chain reaction in order to disconnect the inverter as it happens.